All right, so let's talk about this case that's in the news of a man that got a brain aneurysm from his mouth. Is this a thing? Absolutely. So this is the story of a 49-year-old man who developed a brain and heart infection from a cavity. So we all have natural bacteria that lives in our mouth called strep mutans, and it can actually seed the bloodstream from a variety of ways. It can be from brushing your teeth. It can be from having a tooth infection. And naturally, your body would clear it through your immune system. However, in some cases, the bacteria can spread through your bloodstream. In this case, it infected his heart valves, and he got an infection called an endocarditis. So if your heart valves are infected, your blood pumps through an infected machine and bacteria can spread throughout the body, including your brain. There are many types of aneurysms which can happen within the brain, but a mycotic aneurysm is where the bacteria actually infect the walls of the blood vessels and then start to dilate or form a balloon on the vessel itself. Now this can be potentially life-threatening, and in his case, they tried to treat it with antibiotics and it was unsuccessful. So he underwent an eight-hour surgery in order to have this aneurysm corrected. Since mycotic aneurysms are not like classic aneurysms that can be just clipped, he had to have a rerouting vascular procedure in order to bypass this aneurysm. He subsequently recovered from this and then underwent another heart surgery to correct his infected heart valves. The good news is he survived both procedures and is back to 100%.